What is going on everybody? This is Josh back again with another video and this one's been out for a while. It's been out for a really long time. I mean way before I even started my channel. I, I've been wanting to actually talk about this one. Um, I just never got to it. I mean I, the start of a new channel I figured I might as well just bring it up. I don't know if this is going to be the last season of it but I'm going to let's see if, if I should continue to react to it. You guys let me know if I should react to this every single episode. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. This is about to be Brooklyn Nine Nine, Season Seven, Episode One. Let's get into it. We all know Scully has the hardest head, but what concerns me is the speed factor. Squaw, listen up. Not now, Terry. We're having an argument about who would win in a fight if we couldn't use our arms. Everyone agrees <laughs> I'd bite the best. There's been an assassination attempt. What? And you let us just sit around talking about Boyle's pelvis? I didn't let you. <laughs> Councilman Bosworth was giving a speech at Garfield Plaza. He was shot in the shoulder. Shooter is still at large. We have to move. I think our man is still inside the area. ESU is on site. I'll be leading the op from a mobile command center. Santiago is running perimeter control. This thing is just moving. Quick. Manhunt for the shooter. Oh my god, it's a manhunt. And I'm the man hunter. And I'm your sidekick, <laughs> the boy hunter. Come on, dude. I'm gonna, get this. <laughs> I'm gonna look straight into the camera and say, if the shoot whatever, it was a good line. Keep briefing. <laughs> <laughs> to me, Brooklyn Nine Nine, my favorite character is Scully and Hitchcock. I don't know, so every single time they come up in the camera, they always crack me up. Who's responsible for securing the area? Who screwed this up? Hi, I'm Officer Debbie Fogel. I'm so sorry. My partner's on crowd control. I don't know where he went. It's his first week on the job, so he's still learning the ropes. I want your partner off the case. What's his name? It's Raymond Holt. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he got the I mean, Captain Holt. I mean, Captain Dad. I mean, Officer Holt. I mean, Officer Dad. Yep, that was it. <laughs> Officer Dad, I found it. <laughs> Man, I don't remember what happened in the last season. I gotta rewatch that again. I, I don't remember how he got demoted. Let me know if you guys actually remember how he actually got demoted, because I really don't remember. Oh my god, I can't believe that actually happened. I apologize for not properly securing the scene. No need to apologize. I wasn't even that mad. You said you wanted whoever messed up off the case. <laughs> it doesn't matter. The point is, no one needs to get in trouble. Look, you don't have to pity me just because Madeline once demoted me for a year. I've been stripped of my accomplishments and lost the respect of everyone in my life. Including my dog. Cheddar? No. Yes. No. Cheddar? He only poops for Gavin. Oh, sir. <laughs> I have no problem with Detective Peralta being my commander. And I have no problem commanding him. Here, watch this. Captain, will you please lock down North 3rd Street if that's okay with you, Captain? It certainly is. <laughs> if that's okay with you. <laughs> Impressed? You said please and you called him Captain twice. I'm under a lot of pressure and also that dog is a piece of trash. <laughs> okay, it's also also going on. You don't have to pretend to be mad at the dog. First of all, I'm not pretending. That dog sucks. Also... My period's late. I think I might be pregnant. Oh. And I spent all of yesterday in a room with Hitchcock and his new cologne, which can't be good for the baby. It is literally called Zika. Okay. Zika. Wow. <laughs> You're probably not pregnant. It's entirely possible Hitchcock's cologne disrupted your cycle. What's going on here? Is everything okay? Yeah, totes. Right, Rosa? <laughs> uh, totes. <laughs> being all weird today what the hell is that yes sir we'll do we'll be normal okay Boyle it's time for the manhunter to hunt man Ooh, here he comes watch out man that background looks fake down. Ooh, here he comes Chase a man hunter Charles I love that keep doing the song while I work the scene you got it okay bullet lodge there is four feet below the hole in the backdrop indicating a trajectory of about 15 he's snapping while he's, he's trying to do some investigation of one of the buildings across oh the my god Ooh, here he comes. that building's windows don't open Watch out, man. <laughs> hunt you down. that one's obscured by trees Ooh, here he comes Which means the shooter must have been located on the sky bridge a man hunter sorry would you like me to pick the evidence marker back up so you can place it on the ground yes no of course not <laughs> good work i bet, I bet the, the shooter went, went that way, way. Ooh. Sorry. Yeah, it's okay. They're gonna be bumping some heads. Follow me to the service entrance. Ugh, we did it again. I'm so sorry. No problem. Great. Follow me, everyone. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm still gonna crack the case. I cracked the case. Come on. All right, let's call it in and give a statement to the press. Great idea. He knows that I meant I would give the statement, right? And if the shooter's watching, <laughs> I hope you like living between St. Charles Place. A great line from a great man. Or should I say, man hunter? Yeah. He overstepped. <laughs> he took the manhunter. <laughs> there you are. I can't believe you left your post again. Detectives, I'm sorry for my partner's bad boy behavior. I am not a bad boy. I'm trying to catch bad boys. If anything, <laughs> I'm a good boy. What do you want us? Someone matching our shooter's profile was just seen over on Atlantic and Fourth. I need you both there immediately. Can you handle it? Absolutely not. It sounds like way too much responsibility. <laughs> Don't listen to Debbie. We're on she it. Absolutely right. not. 
Bye. What's going on? The guy's on Hoyt Street. I know. I gave Holt a fake lead to get rid of him. Don't worry. I'm still the Manhunter. Why are you guys being all weird again? We're not being weird. Do not dab. <laughs> I wasn't going to. I know what's going on here. You do? Yeah. You're talking about me. What are you talking about then? Our favorite porns. What? It's true. <laughs> there are specific favorite porns we're talking about. Yeah. Okay. Legally, I feel as though I need to back away. I wonder if he felt some type of way about that because he he admitted that he has a porn addiction. He's running, call it in. Damn it. That's <laughs> Charles. Your name's not Charles, it's Boy Hunter. You know what? You earned it. Way to get your boy, Boy Hunter. We gotta start brainstorming headlines for tomorrow's paper. I have a headline. Pitt Clooney laughed at Dick Peralta for arresting the wrong man. Well, I don't know if they would laugh at me per se, but if you just say I got the wrong man. <laughs> sent Debbie and me off on a wild goose chase. Oh, so you figured that out? Well, Debbie did. She's quite the detective. Oh, I'm really not. I'm just always being given meaningless tasks, <laughs> and I'm not complaining. <laughs> so what? You're just saying we have the wrong guy now? Because the hot dog man is the shooter. What? That seems like a reach. Sometimes when you reach, you grab the truth. You turned it around on me. The hot dog man gave a false statement to throw us off the scent and then vanished while we were off looking for the wrong guy. If anything, you're a wrong man, Hunter. <gasps> dare you? <laughs> this is crazy. You're just making up a song because you can't stand the fact that you got demoted. Okay, fine. Here's one. We're lifting the lockdown. Go pick up cones. I have the wrong guy. You cannot lift the lockdown. Go pick up cones. That's an order. No. Fine, then you're off the case. Good. <laughs> Change of plans. We're not going back to the precinct. Are we going to go rogue and pick up cones? Oh, we're going <laughs> way more rogue than picking up cones. <laughs> Listen, it's unlikely our shooter had his own hot dog cart. Are we going to go wrong and pick up cones? <laughs> Mike, you tag along. Great. I choose to nervously tag along. I'm liking her. She's hilarious. Look, but who do we know that could find us a random New York hot dog guy? <laughs> I knew it was going to be those guys. Oh, my God. They cracked me up. So, you need a little help from the Wiener Warriors. Well, I hate that. Just tell us what you <laughs> the know. The Wiener please. Warriors. There's dogs. He serves them up real plus. Just tell us who has a card at 6th and 11th. Oh, there's no hot dog carts there. What? Never? No way. Not a chance. Stoning issue. Forget about it, Jake. It's Hunger Town. <laughs> oh, my God. Holt was right. Officer Holt? Officer Holt, do you copy? Okay, cop. Turn it off. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die before I ever got to find my twin sister's killer. What? That's the reason I joined the force, remember? To find the man who murdered my twin sister. That's my whole story. Debbie, there's no way you told me that. <laughs> Ugh, nothing's working. Maybe you just need to laugh. Here. That's a good story, though. Being trampled by I mean, Holt's not answering his radio. I think he and Debbie might be in trouble. It's just us, man. You don't have to pretend to care about Debbie. Rosa! What? We barely know her, and she's annoying. She's always trying to get me to be friends with her on that weird app for pedicures. It's a pedometer oh, app. That's messed up. It's a pedometer app. We can use the social features to track her. It's $80. Uh, Boyle, you should download it. You get better service here. <laughs> Smart. And I'll upgrade to ad free, too. Smart. Okay, let's move. NYPD, nobody move! You're surrounded. Don't do anything stupid. Looks like we got ourselves a standoff. Fine by us. We got all the time in the world. What? <laughs> uh, I gotta pee! Uh, uh, oh. Perfect secure. Great! Okay, cool. I gotta go. You guys are good, right? Bye! <laughs> Thanks for saving us, Brawl. No matter what uniform you wear, I'm always gonna love you. I mean, cherish. <laughs> I mean, respect. You said respect, right? Yes. Yep. So, do you have any orders for me, sir? Well, I do actually still need those cones picked up. <laughs> We're on it. We got cone That's duty? <laughs> yes! Best birthday yet. It's your birthday? Honestly, I was secretly bummed when the test came back negative. Should we just start trying? Seriously? <laughs> Yeah, seriously. Oh, is that what this season's gonna be about? They're having a baby? I kind of feel like this might be the last. I think this might oh, be the last season. Wait, it's after 11. My oh. interview, it's supposed to be on the news. An incredible conclusion to a terrifying day. And we were able to get a comment from the men who helped solve this case. They call <laughs> <our> <laughs> <warrior>. <laughs> No! <laughs> Oh my god, this show is hilarious. Oh my god. This show is always funny. It's fun. It's a cop show, but it's not your average cop show. It's a hilarious cop show. It's always end up having some murders or something like that, but it's never serious. It's not like no Law and Order, Criminal Minds, or Blue Bloods. There's nothing like that. This, this is just all jokes. But 
it's still something good to watch. Uh, let me know what you guys actually think. Let me know if you actually think I should actually continue to react to this. I don't know. It's only one episode in. Uh, I think the episode two already came out, but let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to comment. And especially, don't forget to subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.